My name is Carlton Lou. My question is for you. It, it's my understanding that a few years ago, when Virginia was wrestling with some budget problems of its own, that you broke rank with the conservatives in the Virginia General Assembly and voted for, I believe it was Mr. Kane's $1.4 billion tax increase. And I'd like to hear you explain that. I'm sure you have a good reason. Thank you for the question. Uh, back in 2004, I was in the House of Delegates. I was not in the State Senate. Uh, in Virginia, we have to adopt a balanced budget every two years, and that's our constitutional obligation. In that year, we came up short, and we came up, came through our two months, you know, we're in the legislature for two months out of the year. January and February came up. We didn't have a budget. We had to balance it. We got to March, April, May, in June, we were looking at June 30th, and we were facing either uh, a government shutdown or adopting a tax compromise. It was Governor Warner, who was governor of the town. He proposed a $4 billion tax increase. I was in the House, and we had stood at zero. I was one of 17, 18 other Republicans who felt like we had had to adopt a compromise. Not something that I wanted to do, but we had to adopt a compromise to avoid a government shutdown so that we uh, we would retain our AAA bond rating, we wouldn't send troopers home, we wouldn't send teachers home. Uh, we can't operate on a continuing resolution like, like they do in Washington, D.C. So while there are a lot of people, and I respect the opinion that you, we should have let the government shut down, I did not feel that was within my, my, uh, with, within my constitutional uh, oath. I will tell you this, I, over the course of my 10 years, I voted time and time and time again against tax increases. I stood against them. I, I had voted to repeal tax increases, uh, like the estate tax. And if you look at my uh, look at my record, I've always voted for balanced budgets. And I've voted against budgets when they weren't balanced. And I'm serious about it. I've signed their tax pledge. Thank you for the very good question.